A local woman's talent for crochet is being used to comfort the families of the Uvalde shooting victims. She's making blankets for them. Our Simone Simpson spoke to the woman on what it means to reach out to those affected by the tragedy. Brian, Maria Martinez is grateful to use her gift of crocheting to help those in Uvalde. Tracy Weaver has decided to give Uvalde families something they can cherish forever, which is made possible with Maria's craftsmanship. In one day, I can get two, possibly three blankets in one day. Meet Maria Martinez. The blankets are going to be the school colors. And I'm going to be making a total of 21 blankets all together. Self-taught, she's on a mission to make sure families in Uvalde have something to hold on to. And all the love that's going into making these blankets, that's, that's my uh, project right there. That's my goal. But Maria was appointed to her role in this project. This lady on Facebook, Tracy Lynn, she saw a, one of my posts on there. I responded to her thinking could she help me with this project of course Maria agreed and I told her well yeah I mean I would be honored it would be an honor for me to make those blankets at no cost to Maria Tracy would pay for what Maria needed it's really touched my heart to be able to help other people in need who would have thought that Tracy running into this Facebook ad could lead into something more? We're strangers. We're now good friends. Good friends on a mission to help those who have lost so much. Look forward to being able to go to Uvalde, Texas to present these blankets to the families that have lost loved ones. The price of them is priceless. It's, it's the time the effort and the love that I put into making those things. That's what I look for when I do my crocheting. Maria has completed about six blankets so far. She's working on her seventh one tonight. If you would like to donate yarn, find them on Facebook at The Heart of Giving Corpus Christi. The group has about 4,000 members. We'll have a link to the page on our site, ktriplitv.com.